Ah, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I'd particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. <laughs> Mimir, are you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. That dragon sculpture is not bad. First time someone's told me that, I suppose. We need more special equipment to use this.
One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't shut it down. Chalk a block with materials that could help us. I'd grab whatever it spits up in the process. If the dwarves agreed to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They made their choice. Worse or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. Brother, before we leave, perhaps it might serve us to check the rig and see if it spat anything up. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfime ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it. Feathery spy. Is it always moral to kill something that's... trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. <laughs> Oh! 
No. It's still here. What? The island near the geyser. We need to get the key from it and unlock this door. We need... I need... to set right a very old wrong. Bloody Grogger hole! We've got to clear out all these undead bastards! <laughs> Door. A prisoner of sorts. <gasps> Early these rigs come to me. I had them built to harvest ore for armaments, essentially harnessing resources that would otherwise go to the dwarves. You think shutting these things down will help the dwarves become independent? I don't know, but I have to try something. There's another mining rig on this island, brother. Smell that smoke. Why would the dwarves agree to work for the Ace here in the first place? That's the heart of it, eh? You lied to them. I lied. Bet we could swing across that, uh, lift thing. Gantry. Gantry. Thanks. Smell fuel. Bet a spot from your blades would cause quite a boom. Surprised the dwarves didn't shut these rigs off themselves. One or two tried. <laughs> the Ein Haryar made examples of them. They killed the dwarves? Couldn't you have convinced them not to? Aye.
should help. I think we can reach it there. <laughs> yeah, that looks right. So hard. Okay, Mimir. To the blacksmiths of Svartalfheim, the creation of a weapon was a sacred thing. What? But Odin just wanted as many blades as he could get, as fast as he could get them. With every stolen resource and mediocre blade, the dwarves lost a bit of themselves. Go. Every last dwarf in Svartalfheim. If he couldn't use their skills, no one could. <clears throat> Jaffa. Vimir, how many stories have you told about Odin and Thor? And all the bad things they've done? 
Let's see how many we can remember. Seems like Father could use his memory refreshed. My memory of them requires no refreshment. They invaded our home. Yeah, but I'm talking about history. All the other people they've hurt. Let's see. Not now. That crane still works? Smell the smoke? There's another mining rig here. You speak of your deeds with shame. Do you regret not allowing Putin to kill them? I don't. No. If the dwarves didn't like working for Asgard, couldn't they just quit? And do what? Their newly built forges poisoned the soil of Svartalfheim. Unable to grow their own food, they had to buy it from Asgard. If they stopped working, they'd be taking food out of their own mouths. Oh, that's clever. And awful. Seed to Muspelheim. Think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago? What makes you say that? We're still thinking, I guess. Going through Surtur's gauntlet. It was fun. It was training. You didn't have fun? Hmm. Well, anyway. You should look for the other half of the seed. Once it's whole again, you can see where it leads. <laughs> Great. Now we can make it across. Keep coming! She's a Bergsra! Spawning a little wretch is like there's no tomorrow! For her, it will be so!
Brother, I had a thought. What if we took a stealthy approach to our next battle? No. It is done. If you could call so meager a task done. A wee drop out of the Asgardian occupational bucket. You must live with your deeds, but do not be troubled by them, brother. Oh? And why not? You were given an impossible problem. Do not blame yourself for failing to solve it. I'm sure the dwarves will feel differently. This doesn't fix them. No. But it is a start. A reminder, brother. That Svartalfine slag we collected could be of considerable use in the hands of Brock or Sindri. The air smells a lot cleaner. It's because we shut down the rigs. Atreus, you are getting better. Faster. I'd even be better than you one day, huh? If you are not, I have failed. Oh. This is the safety office? Well, the sign of hair's breadth away from a head injury up there certainly gives that impression. For Durlin? You have an appointment? Uh, no. Has anyone ever had an appointment here? <laughs> Here to collect on something, pal. Think uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is gonna scare me into somehow approving Estrid's accretion proposal, eh? We are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. <clears throat> He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get... You chop her head off with that too, eh? She was my wife. Dina and I wondered where she went after our little coup here failed. Failed? Yeah, come, come. Failed. Faye is dead. Best of them all. One's left alive after pay the price. 
I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin and free Svartalfheim from the Aesir. Now, I'm not in the business of crossing the old father anymore. Wait, before you go. Take this. What is it? A fine. Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the old father's given name and, uh, yeah, yeah. For fucking up my desk! A fine? Pay it at your leisure, okay? Get out of my office. Hey there. So what about get out of my office? Don't you understand? You said her name was Diener? Oh, uh, sure. Thank you. I think. Hey. This isn't a fine. Not now. There are enemies ahead. Okay, as I was saying, I think Derlin wrote down directions. The dwarf has given us a map. Sort of. Uh, you smelled him? But it seems to lead to a mine beyond that mountain. Ah. Tyr! Derlin helped us anyway. Not everyone uses axes and arrows to fight. Big gate looks like it leads towards the mountain. 
could be a way to the mine. This thing looks like it can take us up the mountain. Maybe we'll be able to see a mine up there. Ah, nothing quite like a dwarven train ride. We can take that train up the mountain when you're ready, brother. Hearing. No one said it until you did, just now. Darling, he didn't need to say it, brother. It was written all over his face. Uh, well, burned, I should say. Into his head. He burned that into Derlin's head? Failed rebellions tend to warrant swift and enduring retribution. He is a captain of Odin. Aye, and the bearer of Galahorn. A true believer, that one. There are few things so dangerous in a man as lack of doubt. like we're here. Come on. This way. I can see another train. Let's look for a way to get over there. You know, maybe finding tears is our best protection. It seemed like Odin really didn't want us to find it. Once Tyr's free and can be God of War again, Odin won't have time to worry about us. If that is his war to fight, he may have it.
We may need some special equipment to use this. Is that a Trekkie? What happened here? Use caution. I think it's dead. Yep, definitely dead. Hey, I wonder if... Atreus! that Drekius what killed the first one we found? If so, it was their aggression that got them both killed. Down there! I can see a mine. That has to be what Derlin was talking about. Tracks up on the left there. Might be another train we can take. Father, what if a war with Odin isn't just tears to fight? What if it's ours, too? War is not the only way. Directories keep coming from that pillar. Mm. Looks like a nest. We're gods. Better gods. We're trying to stop Ragnarok. To help people. And what if the only way to do that is war? Atreus. If you destroy the nest, they might stop coming. <laughs> Forge ahead. Unintended, I imagine.
This thing is small. Okay, we need to go left. Wait, I meant my left. Keep going. We're so close, just a little to the left. Hmm, hopefully that's it. That's way too far. Mimir, tell him left. We're so close, just a little to the left. Yeah, that's it. Round two, here we go. Kraken Hatchling gave you a stone. Kraken? Oh, uh, Thiener. Yeah, covered in algae. I was thinking we could show it to Brock and Sindri when we got back. Here. Okay, so, we came here looking for Tyr because we don't trust Odin, right? If you think about it, war could... Uh-oh.
Whetstone of the Night Ripper. When resisting an occupation, sometimes the most obvious methods are the best. It is old. No longer. Enough about you. I'm talking about the Whetstone. This place is incredible. <laughs> the mouth you had on the train, lad. It's just a word. I've heard way worse from... The word does not matter. You lost control. We were falling through the air. I thought we were gonna die. Is that what you truly wish your last word to be? No. In moments of crisis, panic does nothing. Harness it. Let it serve you. lead into the mine. We'll need to get past this cargo. <laughs> hey, looks like you stopped the water flow on that trough. That's it. Let's head across. <laughs> <laughs> Good bet there's a couple more near here. Let's find them, yeah? be able to get up there if you help me.
That water must have lowered here as the dwarves dug the mine deeper. Wonder what it looked like before they excavated it. <laughs> <laughs> 